Hi there! In today's video, I'll show you how to set up your Samsung Galaxy Tab A9 Plus. Let's get started! So, as a first step, we would need to enable our tablet by holding this power button at the upper part of the tablet. Here is it, how it looks. And now, after you will turn on your tablet, this is the first thing that you are going to see. The welcoming page on different languages. To continue, we would need to click on this blue button here. After this, you would need to select a language that you would like to use your tablet in future. So I'll find English here and then click on it once. After that, we would need to click on this blue button next. And as a next step, we would need to select our country or region. So I'll find my region here and then click restart. After this, your tablet will perform a short restart and we will be back to the setup. After your tablet will be turned on again, as a next step, we would need to agree to some privacy policy, which is this first step. And the second step is optional, which is agreeing to sending of diagnostic data. So I'll not select it and then click this blue button next. As a next step, we are getting suggested to do an easy setup with another device, but I will choose setup manually. Here, as a next step, we would need to choose a Wi-Fi network and connect to it, but we can also do it later, so I'll click skip and then skip. As a next step, we can see the date and time, and if you will need to adjust it because you see that the time zone is not right, you can just simply click on this arrow here and choose the right date and the right time. So I'll click next. As a next step here, we would need to choose the Google services that we would like to use. So I'll disable the send usage and diagnostic data, and this is it. Now we will click accept. And as a next step, we are getting suggested to protect our tablet with face recognition, pin code, password, or pattern. But I'll also skip this step by clicking this button here. Then I will choose skip anyway. And as a next step, we would need to agree to the Samsung service permissions. You can see them right here. I will click agree. And as a next step, we would need to choose our display mode, which can be light. You can see it currently on the screen or dark, which will make all of the apps in black colors. So I'll leave it on the dark and then click this blue button next. And now we would need to wait a little while. And this is it. Now your tablet is all set up and we can click this blue button finish and start using our tablet. That was it for today. I hope this video was helpful for you and thank you so much for watching.